I actually wasn't going to do a video today, but here we go. UFC 302 goes down live on pay-per-view Saturday night, and I wanted to give some of my best bets or best picks over on MMASucker.com. We've got, you know, our betting page. So we do BetMGM, DraftKings, and FanDuel. I'm going to drop what I've put over there uh, in this section. So without further ado, let's get that screen share going. But first, make sure you check out Slappies. Vodka soda, best vodka soda on the market. We're going to go into this, and we're going to go over the DraftKings promo over on MMASucker.com. Now, if you click this here, then you bet $5, and you get $200 in bonus bets. There's no promo code needed. Just simply click claim, and you'll be brought on over to it. Bet $5, and get $200 in bonus bets. It's a great offer. How it works, simply click the sign up button, then make a first deposit of as little as $5. Opt in to receive a no sweat bet token to place an NBA SGP or SGPX. Get $200 in bonus bets credited to your account instantly. All right, so click that link. And then what I have to say for DraftKings is I like to talk about underdogs on this one. And we're going to talk about Alexander Romanov. This guy could land big if the gas tank does not take over and uh, Jelton Almeida takes over when the gas tank kicks in and uh, depletes for Alexander Romanov. But at plus 260, you've got money in the pocket, you got money in the bank, and maybe he'll land a giant shot. So at plus 260, I'm taking that bet over on DraftKings and going to try to let it ride. Nico Price is the another underdog. This guy's always got a puncher's chance. He's got a finisher's chance. He's also got a chance to sort of just pressure the hell out of Alex Morono, who's a minus 258 favorite over on DraftKings. So dabbling some money on Price, as I said, is never a bad thing. He could get the job done, and at a plus 210, maybe dabble a little bit of cash on that. So I go back up to this uh, MMA betting over on MMASucker.com, and I'll click the FanDuel promo. Now this one, again, just click on the claim, no promo needed, no promo code, and if you bet dollars, you get $150 in bonus bets. Sign up for a FanDuel Sportsbook, make a deposit of at least $10 for a seamless experience. Place your first wager of at least $5 on any sports, win or lose, get your $150 in Sportsbook bonus bets upon bet placement within 72 hours. So bonus funds are ineligible for this promotion. But cashed out wagers are ineligible for promotion. Max bonus, $150 in bonus bets. All of the terms and conditions and all that stuff are on this page. And for the FanDuel page, I go over my locks for UFC 302. My first lock is Grant Dawson. This guy's coming in at minus 520, uh, a ground and grappling submission ace. And his grappling skills will be put on full display against Joe Selecki, who's a plus 370 underdog. Again, I mean, he's a minus 520, so you're not going to win much. But if you put him in a parlay, I'm sure he's going to be a lock. And the next one, it's very, very tough to pick against Islam Makachev. I have bet against him in the past, and I have picked against him in uh, MMA Sucker staff picks. But this is one where I'm not going against him. He's a minus 600 favorite. Uh, he could win the fight against uh, plus 420 underdog Dustin Poirier in many, many ways. He could win it on the feet with punches, which, I mean, you you don't really want to stand and bang with Dustin Poirier, but Makachev does have some stand-up skills. He could win it on the mat by taking Dustin down and submitting him because his submission game is ridiculous, and he could grind out a decision because he's got, you know, that style of Habib, and uh, they can grind and grind and grind until the fight is done. So regardless of how he gets it done, I believe the minus 600 favorite will get it done. Does he get it done in the distance? Who knows? But that might be a bet that you take. Regardless, minus 600, you're not going to win much money. But Islam Makachev is still the champ after this one. The final one, if we go over to Bet MGM UFC 30, whoop, UFC 302 promo. Sorry about that. The title should be changed. But get $1,500 in bonus bets. Click on this, promo code LWS for last word on sports. Sign up and deposit $10 or more into your Bet MGM Sportsbook account. Place your first wager and receive up to $1,500 back in bonus bets if you lose. 
The best way to use the BetGM Pro, BetMGM promo for UFC 302. We'll go over the main event, the co-main event, and the fight below that. Uh, as I said, Islam Makachev, hard to bet against him. I wouldn't go against him in the main event. And uh, over on BetMGM, he's a 1.17 favorite. So I think that he is one that could for sure give you some money. Strickland Costa. Now, styles make matchups. This one's an interesting one. Because Costa could get the job done here. He could uh, land a big shot and to land a big strike. Or he could potentially take Sean Strickland down. Who the heck knows? But I'm not picking against Strickland. He's a my uh, pl- blah, blah, blah. he's a 1.40 favorite on Bet MGM, and I think he'll pick Costa apart from the outside. His boxing is crisp. His Philly shell is good, and I think he's just going to pound him away from the outside in this fight and win a decision. And then I, uh, this one I talked about. Uh, Romanov is a 3.40 underdog with Almeida the favorite. This one on BetMGM, I'd say pick the favorite. I'd say Jelton Almeida might get the job done, uh, and it could hit the canvas, and that's where I think Almeida will get the job done if you're going to take, you know, the potential of it hitting the canvas. I know with uh, DraftKings, I said take Alexander Romanov, but with this one, BetMGM, if you're going to place a bet, I'd take Jelton Almeida all day on BetMGM. So... That's a bit of a toss-up. I know it doesn't really make a lot of sense because I'm picking one on one and uh, the other guy on the other, but I want to have my my hands a little... Uh, my hands on all pieces of the puzzle uh, on this UFC 302 card. So let's look at some other fights here. I think the Kevin Holland matchup is a very interesting one. Um, I think he wins it. I think he does not get the finish, but I think he's going to win a decision. I talked about Nico Price, Alex Morono. Randy Brown against Ilizu Zaleski. That's a fun fight. And I think Randy Brown gets the job done in that one. And I don't think I have a hell of a lot more to say about this card. Uh, No, we've gone over all the matches that I want to talk about. Phil Rowe against Jake Matthews. That one could be a grappler's dream as well. Again, with the the Grant Dawson and Joe Selecki one could be a grappler's dream too. So could Mickey Gall versus Basil Hafez. Wow. Uh, If you guys are jiu-jitsu fans, then this card could be a heck of a lot of fun for your viewing pleasure. So that does it. For my bets, head on over to MMASucker.com and click those promos. Again, most of them you don't need promo codes, but make sure you click that like button if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to the channel because about 90% of you guys don't subscribe to the channel. And make sure you check out Slappy's Best Vodka Soda in town. With that, enjoy UFC 302, folks. This weekend will be fun.